I think that the experience at any assisted living facility in the last two and a half years, particularly two and a half years ago, it was scary. At the beginning of the pandemic, the tools that we had for biosecurity were really nasal swabs. Passive testing and, and wastewater testing in particular can be that surveillance that's happening in the background. And I see this as sort of being a fire alarm. One of the big benefits for us having used the wastewater testing is we were able to see in real time a spike in the wastewater that we hadn't detected in our testing. I find life here in New Horizons very pleasant and, and I'm very happy to be here. New Horizons was a facility that was doing a lot of active testing, trying to keep their vulnerable population safe. I got tested today. Why not? I mean, who knows? Someone passing me in the car and I sneezed at me or coughed at me, or whatever. One of the things about testing is that it's expensive. It's time consuming. There's a lot of people that have to be involved in that process every week. As we're moving into this next phase of the pandemic, passive testing and, and wastewater testing in particular can be that surveillance that's happening in the background. There's no disruption on the facility. There's no disruption on the residents. And it's no extra lift to people that are already burdened by their day-to-day -day work that they're doing. We were already using Concentric for the PCR testing. The process itself was quite easy. We walked with the environmental company and looked at you know, blueprints to determine where we thought would be the best place to go. Within two weeks, they were dropping equipment and we were getting results. We are comparing the COVID levels in wastewater to the testing that they were doing at New Horizons. We were trying to compare auto samplers to these more swab passive collection devices. And we noticed before testing showed that there was any COVID present at the facility, we are seeing a spike in COVID level. It was right before Thanksgiving. You know, obviously we're gonna have people that are traveling and coming and going, you're gonna be seeing family. We took that information to really aggressively test the entire property. Instead of doing our routine, you know, you come to us, we're gonna test you and you know, we'll get results. We went to every door in the building, tested every individual, tested all of our staff, and we're able to find you know, a significant uptick of people we had no idea were on the radar, most of which were non-symptomatic. Knowledge is power. And so the more knowledge you have, the more information you have, the more data you have, the more you can make real world changes and kind of make plans on how you're gonna move forward. It has been a tremendous tool for us. It's about putting the residents first. It's about making everyone that lives here their day better than yesterday. The testing programs here are really wonderful. We're doing a good job on that, I feel, here at New Horizons. I really do.